Fiance's Renaissance Tour is in Arlington. Thousands of DFW fans, we call them the Beehive, they are buzzing at AT&T Stadium. I read the tweets. Apparently, it's packed. Our CBS News Chopper was there earlier tonight as they were filing into the stadium in their silver. We got Aaron Jones live outside the stadium tonight with uh, one of the many things that those fans have in common. Yes, all night long we've seen fans dressed in silver. They told us that Beyonce herself requested this. She wanted them to wear silver to resemble a giant disco ball. And some even told us that some of the local stores sold out of these silver outfits days in advance. Everybody wanting to look their best. So this one she dedicated this song to the beehive. It's pure honey and on the back it says it should cost a billion to look this good. Getting good tickets wasn't easy and they sure weren't cheap. I think the last time I saw Beyonce it was like 400 together for two people and I paid 400 just for myself this time. But for Beyonce fans it's more than worth it to see Queen Bee in person. We weren't the Swifty type so this is more like our goal. I'm looking for, forward to Church Girl being uh, sang and maybe like one of an, like an old song like Diva. So I got this like two weeks ago. Concert goers putting a lot of effort into their outfits. Beyonce asking everyone to wear silver. I saw hats that were like 200 300 dollars and I'm like I'm not about to pay all that money so I, I DIY my hat myself. I'm actually working at Ulta Beauty and one of the stylists is there. She put the tinsel in my hair and then um, I also have a friend who helped braid it the front of my hair. If you don't want to get lost in a sea of silver, this is definitely the outfit that you need to wear. Pink Lucy boutique owner Tiffany Walker says she's recently seen a 40% increase in sales because of this. We actually had to find more seamstresses and cutters in order to make sure that we could fulfill all the orders that we had. So it has really been a blessing for us. Dressed to the nines, fans ready to dance the night away, calling this a once in a lifetime opportunity. So I don't think she would tour anymore. I think this is her, her big like finale type of deal. And that's why some of the fans that we spoke to tonight say after tonight's concert, they plan to head to Houston this weekend to catch her again. They don't want to miss this opportunity. Reporting live in Arlington, Aaron Jones, CBS News, Texas.